guys, it's JackSparrow123 and we're here on the Gaming Evolved server and I am doing a video on the underwater base which is right there and let's get started. All I'm going to need right now is some tools which is the scuba gear, the scuba tank, the scuba legging, and the scuba flippers. If you're wondering where this location is, it is at... I forget. I'll show you when I'm down there, I'm guessing. So let's really quickly swim down and I'll show you what it looks like down here. I know I said that I'm going to do a challenge where I only live on the ship, but that challenge can't be done because of reasons. I can't explain all the reasons, but the first reason is that um, I can't get a lot of dinos and I can't get a lot of land and I can't really make electronics. Also when you jump up it kind of boosts you and it comes with a lot of stuff here. And when I say a lot I mean look at all of this. So my main plan is to leave that as my harvest section, build this as a base and all of that. So I will be back when I have all the materials and I'm ready to get started so see you guys soon okay and we're back so the main part of the base is just going to be over here I don't really need any of these stuff so I'm going to build the base kind of in the corner here because I can't pick any of this stuff up so let's get started I'll start it off here and work my way over to this side and I don't mean the far side I just mean like a little square okay and now let's go forward hopefully the terrain doesn't get in the way if it does I'll have to modify and when I say modify I don't mean anything that's like cheating and when I say modify I mean like break a lot of stuff and build pillars and all that but I don't have to and I didn't get enough materials so yeah we're going to need a lot more best part about having an underwater base is all of the resources we've got crystals everywhere for you the only bad thing is the dangers which you have a lot of stuff that might spawn and try and kill you. But once you get all of that settled, you should be fine. Get a, like 15 dunkles and you'll be clean and clear. So I'll be back when I have enough of the resources to make the underwater base. And I just had a really bad leg. I don't know why. Also, I'm back to using OBS. I got a few settings that worked. I would like to thank every member of the GE for helping me out. And a special thanks for Meg for telling me how to use Game Capture with the new settings. And the new anti-cheat thing. Okay, guys. We're back. Um, or I'm back. I found my base, my underwater one, again. And I'm just finishing up crafting all of this, so then I'm going to take Mr. Beaver and go under the water to see if we can get it all. Anyway, so I'm going to just equip my scuba gear. Mr. Beaver is really just a little defense mechanism for me. Oh, I run out of fiber. That's awesome. Let's not go into the weapons chest. I don't even think I need the beaver. I'm just scared of what's in there. Anything dangerous? Not too well. Anything dangerous might be a little further down. Oh gosh. So scary going under. It 
it's because you don't know what's down. I love that little jump you do. It's obstructed. No, it's not obstructed. Okay. And now we are having ping issues. Best part about this is you don't have to build on this side because there's a wall. Oh gosh, I underestimated how much foundation I needed. I need like... 10 more. I'm back to grinding out some wood. Actually, we can just start building the walls now. I should have just stacked up on everything. I am going to need to build it right about to here. That's a waste doing that right now. I'll make the door there. Let's hope we can... What the heck? Oh, it's because I was crouched. There we go. Cleaned th that up. So, I'll be back when I fill this part in. Okay, guys, we're back. I know, that's Treyarch's thing, but I'm going to use it for just a second. Um, I've got the base kind of set up. Um, all I need now is a door frame and a door. So that won't take much. Craft that. Craft that. And... I know this video's been pretty short so far, and I'm sorry about it. Next video will be eight times longer. I'm kidding, not eight times, but it will be a better video. Because we're going to be planning on using the update that has just come out either today or yesterday, depending on when this episode came out. And I'm really excited for it personally, because we're going to have a lot of good things. So... Let's finish up this part of the base. There we go. Now here's our little base. And now let's kind of go up to our raft and grab something. It's a dinosaur gate for the base. I could craft the door right now, but I already have a door ready. Okay, here we go. Let's go down. We have a lot of little buddies with us. Okay, there's a ship right there. Oh, wait, no, it's right there. Now, to anyone wondering why I'm not so scared of the water right now, it's because just look at what I have with me. Who is scared of the water with those? Normally, I have a phobia of water and everything. Where did the door go? Huh. I guess I lost the door. Um... What else can we craft? Can we craft the bed? Okay. Yeah, we can craft the bed. Bed. Let's craft four. And what else should we craft? We should get storage. So let's go structures. Wood crafting. Okay. Wood.
wood in storage. I don't have any wood. So that's a bit of a shame. Thankfully, we have our base now. Our dinos shouldn't die. Because they're going to be eating meat and all of that and killing stuff that spawn around here. The base is going to get changes over time and lots of the changes I hope you guys like. If you don't then I might just take those changes back. Anyways keep me posted on it and let's get ready for the next episode. See all you guys. Later!